Hello everyone, assalamu alaikum, welcome back to my channel, welcome if you're new here. So today I'm going to be filming a pretty short and sweet home bargains haul for January 2021. We've literally just heard the news that there's going to be another lockdown. I don't think any of us are very surprised about it. We're just finding out what's going to happen. Um, excuse my dishevelled experience disheveled appearance i have been shopping um in home bargains and b and m and i did a bit of like you know asian food shopping as well just been doing errands and things so i'm a little bit all over the place but i thought i'd sit down quickly and film a little home bargains haul and there will be a bnm haul which is slightly longer coming up as well soon so the first thing let's get straight into it i actually repurchased this the microfiber drying dish mat and it's one pound 99 and the reason why i repurchased mine i got this back in i think it was October and um, the reason why I repurchased it is because I feel like it has got a little bit tatty I use it every single day whenever I wash my dishes and I feel like it has like died out a little bit and unfortunately um, I put it in a wash and it was not a good idea now it says at the back that you have to machine wash it cold I didn't know that and uh, it can be dry cleaned tumble dry on low heat um, but on 30 degrees I think I put it on 40 and so my other ones a little bit crumpled and whatever but this does definitely does the job of like collecting excess water once you've done the dishes and yeah it's a pretty affordable purchase so 199 couldn't really go wrong and then I came across this set of silicone straws and it's also got um, a little cleaning brush as well which I have quite a few of these now so you get four straws in here and the cleaning brush and these were £1.49 for the whole pack which I thought was really really good do you know what I just thought this would be great because I have the rose gold copper kind of straws already do you know with those ones I personally don't love the metallic sort of taste that you get with the metal straws but the other thing is I find that they're, they're very very narrow and these ones are definitely wider so they're going to be better for smoothies and things like that and you can use them with hot beverages as well as cold and they're BPA and lead free so there's loads and loads of amazing things about those straws and for 150 I thought it was a really good price the next thing that I purchased is this basic water bottle it just says H2O on the go it's got a blue straw on it and what I liked about this one is it has timings on the side so this was £2.49 really really great price if you look for like timer water bottles on Amazon they tend to be around £10 which I find a bit bizarre I'm like it's just a water bottle, dude. It, sh it should not be that expensive. So if you're looking for a really good one, this starts from 8am and it goes to 12pm and you refill it and then it goes from 2pm up to 6pm. My target, really, my realistic target for 2021 is to drink one of these a day. That should be easy. Like, I feel like when I'm at work, obviously pre-mask days, I could do that really easily. But sometimes at home, I just forget. And I definitely know for me, having a bottle of water, I just prefer it to having a glass of water. I feel like with glasses of water, like, I'm always worried that, like, something settled in there, like, dust has gone in there. Or I just don't like it when there's all those bubbles in there. I don't know. I don't know if you guys know what I mean, but I prefer having a water bottle and unfortunately Wakara accidentally dropped mine yesterday. Yesterday he was being very sweet and he was filling up my water bottle and his, which is quite a big deal, trying to get him back into drinking water because it's very, very bad for it. And here in Dundee, we're so lucky, like in Scotland, our water from our taps literally tastes like, like bottled water. It's incredible and it's got such a nice taste. And I find it hard now to drink water down south, which is so bad because I've lived there for the vast majority of my life. But the Scottish water is just something so gorgeous about it. Anyway, so he was filling up our water bottles and unfortunately he dropped mine. And it wasn't even from a very big height at all, but it literally like cracked and smashed. It was a plastic bottle, which was crazy, but it just, the bottom bit all smashed. So yes, had to pick up another one. And uh, I like, I like the fact it's got timings on it. Whether I'll use those or not, we'll see. But I just, I just like the little tracker thing. It's pretty cute. Then I purchased some pencils. So these are the Stadlitzer Wood Free 10 pack pencils for 99p, which is great. I don't really know like what to say about this. It's stationery. I love stationery. I've got a whole drawer full of stationery in this room now. And I, I just, I really like this for when I'm planning ahead. So when I'm writing down my plans for like my YouTube videos and my Instagram posts, but obviously sometimes things change. So having it in pencil first, it just gives me a bit of peace of mind that I can change it around. And yeah, like 10 for a pound is a bargain. I could not resist picking up these two bowls. A tiny little white one, this was £1.29 and then you've got a larger one here and it's like it's about that wide and this one was £1.99. 
so they were both pretty affordable and I have actually got a pretty large collection of heart shaped bowls already um, I just find them great like they're good for snacking they're good for popcorn for movies and I also I feel like these ones not that we're gonna have guests anytime soon but these are really good for when you have guests over because you can put like chocolates in this one and like crisps in this one or like the dip in here and Doritos in here so yeah they've already got some of their Valentine stuff out which is crazy because we're not even on the 5th of January let alone the 5th of February yet home bargains is on it when it comes to the next holiday and yeah these are just really cute and um, obviously they're proper dishes as well so they're going to be going with the rest of my heart bowl shaped collection in the kitchen very soon. I also purchased a couple of cars so I got this one to a wonderful mum Today is all about celebrating your birthday and then this one is happy birthday, you're amazing, this is a very sparkly one. I really like Home Bargains and B&M actually for their cards. I find that they're the best value for money, as they are with most things to be fair, but yeah, those are really good. Um, those are both less than a pound each. I'm planning on sending them a couple of things, my mum and my sister, because they were supposed to be coming down or up. They're supposed to be travelling up to Scotland in the Christmas holiday period but obviously that plan got cancelled so now they're not coming anymore. And I also got these two, My Coffee Latte Caramel Macchiato. Although these are not like the best calorie wise and I am back to calorie counting, these have 207 calories per drink which is quite a lot but I do love these for the days that I'm working. They're just like a little perk, a little thing to look forward to in the morning for when I'm getting up way earlier than normal to go to work and to sort of set my day off and I, I have had these before and the caramel flavour is nice, it's not like overly sickly sweet so I just pop these in the fridge when I come home and these are only 59p each so I like to get these ones, I like to get the little ones as well um, and I think I've tried the Aldi ones and they were pretty nice too. I have tried the Starbucks ones which are like pound fifty, and I just think for like a third of the price these are just basically just as good and they're just cheaper as well so if you haven't tried those and you like your caramel flavored coffee go give that a go and then I saw this bed set which I could not resist this was the most expensive thing in this haul is $8.99 but still pretty cheap and this is the uh, pin sonic duvet set it's an easy care super soft set it's for double one it's got two pillowcases in it as well so it's like a plain pink design but then it's just got this like hexagonal design across just a portion of the bedding and yeah I think it's nice to just have new bedding and the bedding in um, our room does tend to be pink but also the bedding in this room sometimes is pink as well so it can go in either or room and I just thought yeah the hotel collection is generally pretty good I've been happy with what I've got before it's washed well as well so for less than £10 for a duvet set it's a pretty like win-win. Then I also purchased this cooling rack. It was £1.29 and it's one of the Jane Asher Rangers. I love the Home Balcon Jane Asher Ranger. Such a high quality baking things for like really affordable accessible prices. And yeah, we just didn't have one of these. So I thought this would be good for some lockdown baking as it seems like we're going to be doing very soon. And then the final thing I purchased from Home Bargains today was this splash guard. It's 28 centimetres and this was £1.79. This is going to be really good for if we're frying anything, uh, which we don't do too often. But sometimes as well, I hate like when you've had the oil on for a bit too long and you put stuff in it, it just starts spattering. So I'm envisaging I'm gonna have this like on the corner like ready to like wham on top of my sauce <laughs> and stop all the splashing happening <laughs> so yeah that was my very short and sweet home bargains haul oh my gosh I'm only been filming for 10 minutes which is crazy <laughs> my videos are never normally this short but yeah those are all the things I picked up from home bargains this time around and let me know what you guys have got if you have got anything recently I definitely I'm so happy that Home Bargains and B&M are still going to be open during lockdown because I love like browsing even if I don't buy much even though it's very hard not to buy much because I always find good deals in there. There's also a couple of cute things that I put on my Instagram stories. I'll leave them on here if I remember um, to have saved them but one of the things is this really gorgeous gold like it's like a drinks tray but I was just like standing there like what could I how could I justify getting this um, and one of um, uh, the lovely the lovely Lima fashion size she was like oh my gosh you could totally use a few skincare and I was like oh, I could but then 
I don't really have space in this room for it because once I've got all my filming equipment and stuff, it just gets so crowded. And then I was thinking that could be a very bougie, like dressing, like not dressing table, bedside table. So I'm thinking about that and I'll let you guys know if I get that in an upcoming vlog. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you've bought anything from Home Bargains recently and hit the thumbs up if you enjoyed it and stay tuned for my next home haul, which is going to be a B&M one which is a little bit longer. <laughs> okay, take care guys. Bye.